Whoop. Hey everybody, it's Professor Powerline, and welcome back to more Let's Play Skyrim. In the last episode, we met some of the worst thieves I've ever seen in my entire life, killed a dragon, and wound up here in Riften, and we're now heading out to the Ratways. In this episode, hopefully we'll make some considerable progress in there, but we'll see. Alright, so, I gotta say I'm feeling kind of like going to the sewers is a bad idea, so I'm gonna go ahead and equip my, uh, Iron Sword, which is mighty fine, I must say. And let's do this. Okay, so right off the bat here, I have something very interesting that I want to bring up and ask you guys about. So up ahead here, we have two characters. Both these characters have unique names and a fair amount of dialogue if you actually sit and listen to them. But as near as I can tell, there aren't any quests attached to them. I can't find ways to talk to them, and no one seems to mention them. So my question to you is, are there any quests involving these characters? If so, feel free to tell them about it. In the meantime, I'm just going to go ahead and kill them. Because I do not have the patience for that nonsense right now. Why are they doing so much damage? Ow. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Oh. Ooh. Oh golly. Okay, I need some. I'm gonna need some potions here. Um, let's do some potion of minor healing, like four of those. Thank you for being so polite and waiting for me to drink all that potion. Oh, oh, wait, no. Oh, oh, shoot. shoot, shoot, shoot. Oh, oh, no. Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Stop it. I probably should have taken care of the archer first. That was a poor tactical decision on my part. Yeah, let's just go ahead and search this guy. Uh, weak poison. Oh, actually, I want to check something. Am I still using... Yeah, okay, so there's something I wanted to mention here. I mentioned that for every quest line, I'm going to be using a unique set of armor. Um, and for the uh, quest line that we're in right now, the main quest line is going to use the armor used to promote the game. I actually got the shield wrong. The shield is actually not the iron shield. It is actually the um, band banded iron shield. I don't know. But it's actually this shield right here. So I'm going to go ahead and take and equip that. So, my bad on that. My apologies to anyone who knows who was like yelling at the screen. So, my bad. I'm just going to go ahead and eat some food because I apparently have some time on my hands. And then murder this fool. Um, but yeah, I got the shield wrong. Sorry about that. I'm going to take it with me. Oh! Oh, gee golly. Oh, you're so dead. Oh, I've actually never seen that one before. Oh, that was kind of cool. Okay, how did I get an arrow behind me? Oh, whatever. All right, orcish bow. That's pretty nice, but I'm going to leave it there. Take the amethyst, take the arrows. Because um, I'm going to keep using the bow I've got right now. No, I'm not. Why am I being that stupid? Take the orcish bow. Okay, cool. So, true Skyrim fashion, you go through the dungeon the long way. There's a fast way back out. Well, that's our fast way back out. We just have to knock it down. Um, we're heading this way, though. Quest marker's not going to do you a terrible amount of good in this particular area. Oh, hanging moss. Oh, blades. I actually forgot those were there. Yeah, watch out for trap doors, by the way. Fire. I don't know why, but for some reason, whenever I see oil in this game, I have to burn it. Otherwise, I just can't feel like I've fulfilled my human being obligations to burn everything in sight. Maybe that's just me, though. There we go. Let's put my shield back on. Kill that skeever. Uh, let's see here. Where to go? Oh, 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 oh. We have another really unique character. This character here has a unique name, just like before. Actually, well, he does a lot of damage. I forgot. Oh, my gosh. Um, Let's... Can I... Oh, I think I might actually be in some trouble here. Generation. Restore health. Potion of health. Potion of healing. Okay. Yeah, this character... Another character with a unique enchantment. Oh, never mind. Um, or not. He's got a unique name, and you'd think he'd have a unique story behind him, but again, I can't seem to find it. I feel like the Ratway is the, um, land of mispotential. But make sure you loot this guy. You want his gloves. You cannot find this enchantment anywhere else in the game, so be sure to take those. Because if nothing else, you can disenchant them and improve your enchanting level. So, yeah, he, he's a, strike me as some kind of boxer or something like that? I don't know. Wait, was that a bear pelt? Bear trap. Okay, I thought I saw a bear pelt. I have like a bear pelt, but now it's not what it was. That's not a thing. This random Legend of Zelda esque grotto. I love it so much. This random axe here. It's like, what on earth is going on in here? Is like a random Nirvana hole or something? I don't even know. 
Okay, so that, that's a thing. I mean, again, no quest line attached to it that I know of. Whoop! And this is like this random gourmet cook down here called Low Life. I find that to be equally entertaining. Die. This is going somewhere fast. It was just trading blows and blocks. There we go. Oh, okay. Slightly getting the upper hand here. I started playing through Skyrim again on my own personal files and have been like obsessed with swords and shields, so. Oh, and I also started another character where I'm using like just bow. I've played through this game so many times. Oh, I think that's a skill book, actually. Yes, it is in fact a pickpocket skill book. Make sure you stop and read that. Oh, here we are. We've arrived at our destination. The Raggle Flagon. Once again, I feel like the Thieves Guild has a terrible hiding spot because everyone seems to know about it. How hard would it be to send a SWAT team down here and just knock them out? Okay, yeah, so remember how I told you that the main quest line is kind of cross-contaminated with the uh, Thieves Guild quest line? So if we stop and talk to um, Brim Brimyol, Brimyol, I never know how to pronounce his name, we can start the Thieves Guild quest line, and believe me, we will be doing that at some point, but for right now, we're just going to go right past this guy and totally ignore them and go to Esburn's um, hideout. So just completely ignore these guys, they're not relevant, and head through this door right here. Because no one cares what they have to say. All right, huh? what was that? Thalmor soldiers. Oh boy, looks like they beat us here, guys. No worries though, just something to kill, right? Or maybe I can just get killed. That's a distinct possibility. Why am I doing damage to the person? Oh look, traps. Just go ahead and loot them, person. Uh, nope, nothing I really want there. Ooh, this this guy. Um, ooh, silver ring. I'll take that. I'm gonna go ahead and equip my healing because I don't think shields are gonna do a lot of uh, good against um, Thalmor wizards. So we're just gonna go ahead and heal and try and get some restoration magic up. All right, let's see where are these goofs. Oh, hey, what's up, buddy? Ooh, look at you. You have a uh, summoning sword. That's pretty cool. Oh, torches are also pretty cool because they're like shields with a little bit of extra light, and if you shield bash, you can light people on fire. So that's, that's pretty cool. I'll actually take a few with me. Not that I ever use them, but I'll take them with me anyway. Take their arrows. Um, oh! Oh, shoot. Actually, you know what? You know what? You know what? We're gonna go ahead and favor the torch and equip it to our shield hand and block this fool and light him on fire. Not entirely sure why that works, but I'll take it anyway. Oh, wait. No, shoot. Um... Oh, I don't have stamina. If, apparently, if you don't have stamina, you can't whack with your left hand. Whacking with your right hand is just fine. Don't ask me why. Just go with it. Wait. Oh, that was a chick, I think. Oh. That's slightly a bummer. Oh, well. Alright. Stealthy, stealthy, stealthy! I want my healing back, actually. There we go. Healing's one of those things you usually like, no matter what class you are. I mean, it's just so useful. It's not actually terribly useful, but it's hard not to. Oh, oh crap! I just grabbed that useless hammer. All right, is can I? No, I need corundium. Hang it! I think that's how you pronounce that. Oh, why can't I improve this? Why? Oh, because it's got an enchantment on it, right? I don't have arcane smithing yet. Oh, just just got something. Oh, uh, gold lockpicks. There we go onward and let's put our torches back on Whew, I was torch in the face oh I love these these are random little chests that are never used ever again why game designers would you do that design you, oh this one's actually got a lock on it okay we'll do that real quick I guess nope shoot okay is it down nope it's more around here ish nope a little bit more here ish done Lock picking up. Got some healing potions. I needed that. Grab these coin purses. Got some gold there. I want to be careful not to grab the drinking glass because they're useless. I don't care for the last two coins. Oh, by the way, torches are consumable. You will eventually use it up if you wait long enough, so be mindful of that. This is nice and bright for being underground. 
wait a minute, did I just go in a circle? I could have just fallen down here. Well, can I light this with my torch? No. Why is there oil leaking in the rat way? I mean, I get that it's supposed to be like this horribly run down kind of sewer deal, but flammable oil where water should be? What are you doing? Just pouring your lanterns down your sewage system? Eh, whatever. Alright, what do we got here? Yeah, I feel like the Ratway is the island of misfit toys for Skyrim. There's just so many characters in here that should have had more attention or quest lines attached to them. That would be my sister in the background, in case you heard that snickering. So, um, yeah. Actually, both my siblings are kind of just chilling in the background. So, <laughs> that's a thing. That's a thing. I thought you should know about the thing. I'm really actually just doing it to irritate them. Alright, let me just try and get this unlocked. But thankfully, they're being nice and respectful, and, you know, not talking when I'm recording, so. Alright, so yeah, here we go. Hilf. Oh, can I pickpocket you? I can! I want your. Ooh, flawless. Why do you have that? Oh, I'll take it anyway. Oh, Never she detected me. Sorry. Sorry. I'm not actually sorry. Now I'm going to take your flawless garment, which is no longer stealing. Now it's just repurposing. Wait a minute. Why are you wearing ragged robes when you have a belted tunic? <sighs> Whatever, okay. Come here, come here. What? I think there's another character in this area right here. Yep, what's up, dog? I had a medal. It had someone's face on it. I threw it away after. It didn't help. It's hopeless. He told me. He's right, you know. I finally understand what it all means. What it was all for. I, the killing. Again. And the dying. So much mispotential. I had a medal. Had right. I guess the only thing I have to do is just murder it. I threw it away after. You're just still talking. Why can't I? Why can't I? Oh my! Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Look at this guy! He's going berserk! It's a really cool way to train your block, but that's enough of that. And off your head. Awesome. Uh, right, so that's interesting. Again, if anyone knows, why is it stealing all of a sudden? Why is it stealing? Why is this stealing? Whatever. So I think this guy was a soldier one time. Uh, that's what I gather from his kind of loosely connected dialogue. Anyway, this looks suspicious, don't you think? Go away. Esbern, open the door. I'm a friend. What? No, that's not me. I'm not Esbern. I don't know what you're talking about. Your text box says Esbern, and I trust the text box. It's okay. Delphine sent me. No worries, brother. I'm on your side. How do you... So you finally found her. And she <laughs> led you to me. And here I am, caught like a rat in a tramp. I totally spaced what he just said. Um, to stop the dragons! Delphine, how do you... Well, this is just a trick to get me to open the door. This is the most paranoid old guy I've ever away. met in my entire life. Right. No, nope. ah, bro, come on. I told you to go away. I'm not opening this door for anybody. <sighs> the 30th of ah, Frostfall. Indeed. Indeed. Uh, I do remember. Delphine really is alive then. You'd better come in then and tell me how you found me. He changes doing pretty quick, don't you think? This will just take a moment. This one always. Starts. Okay. Here we go. Only a couple more. Come on. How many? Oh. Oh my. All right. Okay. There we Let are. me in. Come Thank come you. In. That's better. Good to see you, my friend. No. Close that door. Oh. Oh boy. So Delphine keeps up the fight after all these years. Yeah, sure, something like that. Actually she runs a bar, but you believe whatever you want, my friend. I tried to tell her years ago. Hope Have you figured it out yet? Do tell. What more needs to happen before you all wake up and see what's going on? Aldwin has returned, just like the prophecy said. The dragon from the dawn of time who devours the souls of the dead. 
No one can escape his hunger. Here or in the afterlife, Alduin will devour all things, and the world will end. Nothing can stop him. That's a really ah, dark prophecy, I actually. To tell them. They no listen. escape, even in Truths. death. It's all come true. All I could do was watch our doom approach. So naturally, you hid in the basement. Okay, you're talking about literally the end of the world. Oh yes, it's all been foretold. The end has begun. All dream has returned. Only a dragonborn can stop him. But no dragonborn has been known for centuries. <laughs> oh, my good friend, have I got things to tell you? Fate, or more accurately, shout at you. But that's okay. We can leave the details for another time. Cause I'm dragonborn. You can't tell, but I'm making a fist and shaking at the screen right now, because that's how into these videos I get when I'm really bored. Then, then there is hope. The gods have not abandoned us. We must... We must... We must go quickly now. Take me to Delphine. We have much to discuss. And we will do that next time. Alright, guys. So, next time on Let's Play Skyrim, we'll be starting Alduin's Wall. Um, so yeah, we're gonna try and get, uh, as, as, I almost called it Asper. <laughs> yes, he's a cat with psychic powers that destroys everything in a 300 ra fit radius, but that's a beside the point. Um, so yeah, we're gonna get, uh, Esper in here back to Delphine, and we're going to go over a little bit more about why the Dragonborn makes the end of the world less of a thing. So, um, yeah. If you enjoyed this, um, my work here, I'd appreciate it if you stuck around and subscribed. If you like this video in particular, go ahead and give it a like. It really helps me out. But until then, I'll see you all next time.